struck a sour note among some blacks and created a furor when he presented his impersonation of the famed blackface comedian Burt Williams, a top vaudeville favorite during the pre-World War I era. But before I talk with Ben Vereen, let me offer this brief bit of history. During Burt Williams' time, black performers, in order to work, were required to appear in blackface, that is, wearing a so-called Burt Cork mask. The caricature they were forced to create was a shiftless, watermelon-eating coon, assassin of the English language. There were even so-called coon songs performed by whites in blackface. One title was, You May Be Hawaiian on Old Broadway, But You're Just Another Nigger to Me. That's the era we're going to talk about the late part of the last century and the early part of this one. It was a very difficult time for black people in this country. I, I preface it by saying it was a sick time in America because it was a time when, you can understand, we were just coming out of the fields in the South and uh, during that time the performer were, was uh, running around, the white performers were going around the South during slavery and they, on Sundays used to see the blacks uh, entertaining themselves uh, that was the only day they gave us to have any sort of uh, um, entertainment was on Sundays and, and a couple of uh, white performers came by and saw them dancing and singing in the fields and one of them turned to the other and said, hey, that's a great idea. Why don't we put some cork on our face and we'll imitate the blacks? <laughs> and they, they started a thing called minstrel shows and they went off and started doing their thing and uh, when Reconstruction came about and we came out of the fields and said, hey, let's get in the show business, they said, these guys are doing us so we can do ourselves better than they can do us, except there was a catch-22 to it. You see, they said, you can perform, but you got to be in blackface. If you're not in blackface, then, uh, you can't grace this stage. And so that was our catch. We, we couldn't, we couldn't, we still were in, in slavery, uh, so to speak. 